Uh, Northern Ireland Opera is a great company. It was uh, started eight years ago, and um, it's been a kind of interesting journey, I think, for the company. You know, starting from scratch, really, putting on some really big shows, trying to get the whole of Northern Ireland excited about what opera and uh, cultural activity can, can give us. I mean, Northern Ireland Opera has always had great casts and great singers, um, but we really wanted to push the boat out this time. So. I worked with a fantastic casting director to put together you know, what is one of the world's best casts for Rigoletto. It should be a piece that everybody can understand immediately. I mean, it's about a guy who you know, hates his job, hates his boss, hates his life really. And he's more or less poisoned and blinded by uh, this sense of uh, resentment and his desire to take revenge on the world. So the piece is, it's a lot about paternal love, about you know, the importance of family and about how we get things wrong. Well, basically as part of our outreach week uh, in association with the Grand Opera House, we are inviting a lot of young people from schools, primary schools, post-primary schools. We also have a lot of youth groups, uh, young people with disabilities and learning difficulties. And um, essentially what we're doing is we are running workshops with them and then they get to come into the Grand Opera House auditorium and they get to see the rehearsals happening live for themselves. I think it's really amazing being in close proximity with the power of the human voice. And I think as well, it's a way of demystifying opera, which can seem like something that's quite foreign and quite alien. But when you're actually in the room, experiencing it live, I think it's quite an amazing visceral experience. Well, I think this is probably one of the best operas that are out there. Uh, it's uh, Verdi at its finest. So I really recommend uh, to anyone who's seen it and who, ha especially who hasn't been to the opera to come see it, because this is a good one. I mean, these projects are just essential. I mean, opera cultural life is just an essential part of, 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 of making a great society, making a successful society. And, um, you know, the people who really make this possible, actually the Arts Council of Northern Ireland, um, you know, they distribute the money. They decide where it goes, and you know me personally. I'm incredibly grateful for this opportunity to, you know, to bring such a magical piece and such a magical experience to Belfast and to Northern Ireland as a whole.